Hey everyone, it's been a long time since I put up a video, and honestly, it's it's for a special, very special reason right now. Um, I've been trying to do streaming stuff, um, a lot of internet issues, also big, like, just block of, like, a month of time that I just can't use Mega Peter, pretty much, um, with very small exceptions. Um, but starting, what's the week after we get back? I think it's like the 9th or the 10th of August-ish, somewhere around there. Um, I'll be like, actually like, assuming I get my internet fixed, and even if I don't, maybe I'll just suffer through. Um, I'll be streaming a lot. I'm gonna, my big plan uh, is go, I'm going to be first, my first thing I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be speedrunning Dishonored. That's really what I wanna do. I love it, I did it a little bit. I got like a 41 minute time. I'd like to get a better time. I like to get, you know, decent. Um, but that's just, you know, that's future plans. That's where you want to keep up. Um, the big thing, though, is I'm, I'm honestly so excited and happy and shocked and all these things. Because I was checking my email today because I was signing up for something else and I went to go check. And I saw this weird email. I'm like, that's not usual. So I click on it. And it's from the company Plastic Games. Uh, they are a game, a game company, a very small one, or I guess you say development studio uh, in Connecticut. Um, and they're making this game that you're seeing right here called Bit Shifter Flashpoint. Um, and they, they sent me a code, so yes, this game, heads up, you know, full disclosure, this, they sent me this code, I, there was no money involved, just, just an email, they said, here's a game, feel free to make content on it, we would, you know, we'd appreciate it, and that's it, there's no money, just, they send me a free copy of the game. Um, I do believe this is a beta version, it is, the game's not out yet, it is, this is beta, so, things are, I believe, subject to change. Um, I've got the email open here so I can read any information. I don't want to get anything wrong here. Especially since this is my first, that's the thing. This is the first time someone's, or a company, I should say, is sending me a free game, especially, you know, exp explicitly to make content for. And that's why I'm making a YouTube video, because I think it's super cool that A, they did it, B, that they did it for me, like, you know, because I'm sure people get videos or games all the time, but it's, they, they found me. You know, my channel's got less than 50 subscribers, you know. What are the odds? So I'm, I'm excited and will gladly make a video for them. Oh, squeak there. Um, so I think we're gonna hop into it. Um, there'll probably be a little bit at the end where I explain like about the company. I guess like one like the big thing I should talk about first, because I honestly know very little about the game other than what the email describes here. Um, is that its release date? The official release date is August eighth. Um, so that's you know keep your eye out for that. It should be available on Steam. Um, and I think that's it about you know you know stuff that I could tell or not that I can. There's really no limits here. Just what I'm going to tell you before we hop in the game and figure out what's going on. Um, so here first we've got this personality ambiguity exception. Please choose. Um, I'm gonna choose male because I'm male, and I have typical vision. At least I don't have red green impaired vision. Um, we can track your usage data to help improve the game. We can we only track a small amount of data when you finish a level, such as playing time. When I lost. Oh yeah, sure. Okay, options. So there's difficulty. There's five of them. Laughable, infinite lives, very slow virus, way less enemies. Oh, user error, pop ups. And there's this nerf thing down here. Ten lives, slow virus is less enemies. Workable, five lives, normal amount of enemies. Regretful, four, faster, more. Three, way, way, okay. I figure we'll go with normal. I really don't know what kind of game it is, so I can't quite judge if it's gonna be if I'm gonna be good at it or not. Um, video options, that's all good. Um, audio, honestly, the volume sounds fine. Hopefully, it is. I mean, I'll see when I'm recording. Ah, oh, crap! I clicked out. Hopefully, that doesn't break anything. Everything over here is still working. Yeah, it looks like we're doing good, so that should be fine. Um, I, yeah, again, we'll find out, I'll find out when I'm actually editing this, whether or not the vo the volume's good. But, hopefully, everything beyond that is fine. I have to wait for it to load back in now, it takes a second. Alright, and controls, um, I will be using a mouse and keyboard at first, as that's my preferred, uh, method of, you know, gameplay. But if it doesn't feel well, um, I'll plug in a controller and see if that's better. Um, because there are plenty of games that come out that are just meant to be played on a controller. Um, and I get that. So I'm gonna go with my preferred method, and if that doesn't work, I'll switch to a controller. Alright, um, info. Oh, info about me, okay. Personalize. Oh, okay, that's that thing. Yeah, we did that, okay. Novice, uh, these are things. I don't know what most of these things mean, but clearly there's upgrades that, like, stack up. 
Um, credits. So you see, here's the credits for Plastic Games. Um, I don't recognize that guy. I don't think I know anyone on the team. Or if they did, I, you know, I haven't heard from them. Um, and then about... Uh, yep, yep, early access, like I said. Um, BitShifterGame.com is their website. I believe you can go there right now. So let's hop in there and see what we got. Ah! Okay, so this right here, at least this bottom part here, I'm not sure about this top part, is a special thing called Bit... something? Like, it's a special language that you can actually... They sent me a... The how you're supposed to read it, um, like, tutorial. I'm just dumb and can't figure it out. So I'm just gonna hope it's this being translated, but I don't actually know. Calling all pilots is general protection of system command. Flash BIOS here. I believe I am Flash BIOS. Flash, it's been too long. General, is there any word from my brother, Rom? Sorry, Flash. Colonel BIOS is still presumed dead. Rude. You don't know that. Mutation Day turned Homeworld into a chaotic mess. Rom was a great soldier. He will be missed. We lost a lot of good bots that day. Ellipses. Flash, I need serious pilots. You really believe you're up to this? All I want now is to find Rom. As for the work, we both know that won't be a problem. I see. Well then let me brief you. Virus is getting past our firewalls and we are reinstating the bit shifter protocol. Bit shifter protocol? That sounds like I'm saying bad words. Yes, we have reclaimed the scan disks from the archive and need skilled pilots to fly them. Can I count on you? Wait, is this an invitation to join System Command? That's right. Promise me you'll help me find what out. Yeah, promise me you'll help find out what happened to my brother, and I'll take care of your virus's problem. The virus pro the virus is everyone's problem, and yes, I promise I'll do everything to in my power to help. I can't read today. And we agree, General. I'm at your disposal. All right, Flash. Report to System Command. I don't know how long this video is going to be. I do want to do a decent length to get an actual first impression of the game. But I am melting in my room, as it is a million degrees. Also, I think my game's exploding. I'm going to give it a second. There's a little meter filling up, I think is what that is. Yes, okay. We're going to give it a second to... Okay, this is a weird issue. I mean, we're going to let it load in. Are we good now? I'm getting so low FPS. Weird. Um, all right, let's read this and figure out maybe we could change some settings. It didn't look like much, but we'll see. Good morning, recruits. This is general protection. Today you will train in the operation of the scan disk. We set up a safe area where you can train and get to know the bits. Your soldiers in the fight. All right, this is the scan disk. I believe we're talking about the ship that I'm currently in right now. It can hold up to eight bits. Today we'll train with two. You can see the little heads bouncing around there. This is a virus. Right now it is safely contained, but its corruption will spread if we don't handle it. Get a handle on it. Deploy your bits to clean the virus. Flash BIOS won the draw, so he will go first. Throw the bits on the virus. Got it. And don't forget to read the mission brief. Okay. Click right mouse button. Throw bit on virus. Hold the right mouse button. Activate bit beam to pick up. And follow your objective. Fly forward... Alright, so we can fly around, look around. Now we need to go over here and throw bits. Okay. okay. This is there an options settings video? Yeah, I mean, there's no like. I guess it's, I could turn down the view distance maybe with that. go real tiny and get 60 frames a second. That's unfortunate. Um, I guess we'll go here and go 30-ish. Ah. Oh! Are we good? Okay. Why is there a big F on my map down there? Okay, there we go. Okay. These are words. Print hello world. Okay, so my little bots are clearing up the virus. Um, so yeah, so so far that's that might be an issue for some people. Like, I don't know exactly why the what about this game kind of 
makes my frames really low. Where are you? There you go. Um, but other than that, like, so far it's been pretty solid. Um, even honestly, even at 30 frames a second, you know, it still feels pretty- What are you? Pew pew pew! What's that thing? Then I gotta pick up you. I'm gonna pick up none of you. Okay. Oh, okay, so we can like fly around and collect all these things. Okay, that's kind of cool. Ooh, that's a tight turn. Bam, bam, bam. Noises. Alright. Drift King! Got him! Oh. Ah, well, I was hit. Okay. Oh, this thing's hitting me. Knock it off. Ah. Virus bombs. Those are bad. I, Major Malfunction, will be your doom. Who is it, it, he just said his name was Major Malfunction. Pay attention. Okay, that's bad. I should be reading this. Sorry. General, do you copy? Any and all channels. This is a flash bios. Please report. I work better alone anyway. Right. Protect the data stream like the general said. I can't let the virus reach the Zor pump. Or the data stream will get infected. I know what to do. I will clean this virus and locate system command. Ow, rude. Where are my people? Oh, there they are. I'm gonna get zippity zapped. Blow up, please. There we go. We need you. Oh, wait. Ugh, wrong button. Okay. Start cleaning this up. Got you protected. Let you guys work on that. I'm gonna look around for those other golden bugs. There should be two more of them, I think. Oh. Here's some more silver bugs. Oh. Alright. The controlling the controlling feels really well. Oh no. Okay. You two. Work on that. There we go. Once the viruses are cleaned, we don't have to worry about that. Now stop this. You stop that from zapping me. And there was a huge... Yeah. Clean that up. Okay. Make sure there's no bugs bothering my friend over here. Nope, we're good here. Cleaning these out. Maybe there's only one gold bug bug per level or something. Or maybe like it's different. Like I said collect three, but maybe it just meant like over over the entire course of the game to collect three to level up. Come on, clean it up. Get out of here. Come on. Yeah! No crashes, we got the major bug, and we beat par. Alright. And we got an achievement, we cleaned one kilobyte. Alright, so that seems good. Alright, no reply yet from Sizzle Command, looks like I'm still on my own. I wonder, is there a way I can get more bits? Yes, Bit Shifter, there is a way. Who are you? Whoa, is the ship talking to me? A scan disk cannot speak. I am the Zor mind. Okay, so how do I get more bits? This machine makes bits. It's called a bit maker. Who would have guessed? It will continue to make bits as you work. 
then I better stop this virus before it hits the data stream. Pow pow! Are you not dead? You're dead. Okay. Get to work. Get to work. Okay. Oh. with me. Okay. Okay, now that the sirens have stopped blaring, we can... Where's the bug shooting at me? There it is. Got those. Deal with you next. Give me them silver bugs. Don't know what these are used for yet. Give me. Ooh, another golden one. Boom. Ow! So I'm injured. Now. We need to find one of those healing buildings. Oh. Come on, how am I not hitting that one? There we go, okay, you pick up the health pack. Like you do these guys. Start cleaning that up. Repair this broken bot. Deal with these bad boys. Got those bugs. Leave them alone. Weird, like, pad thing here. I don't know. Okay. You guys got that. This half of the map seems to be totally clear. pretty well. We just gotta finish clearing this up. A couple busted bots. Dead. There we go. Oh no, you didn't die. But we got that. No crashes, both major bugs found, and we beat we definitely beat par. Alrighty then. Um oh uh, I wish I could see the timer on this video. A second. Hopefully I don't break the game like this. Bam, bam. Twenty minutes? Okay, that's not bad, but I'd probably I'll probably give it an extra couple minutes for like actually recording you know stuff and maintenance um so we'll probably do one more level get three levels in kind of get a feel for it Next level Oop. oh 
Oh, uh, reading. Oh, there's a question mark over there. Zormine, can you give me some give me some way to clean the virus myself? Your request is within parameters. Your gun has been reprogrammed. Shoot at the spot and it will clean the virus. Roger that. Here we go. Okay, so I can now clean viruses myself. Oh, I leveled up. Elf unlock. Ah. Zormine, this maker makes health. Are there other options? Yes, you manually flash the basic input-output system of any blank maker. Are you telling me I can flash its BIOS? Boo. That's, that is correct. Through this teleporter, we'll find blank makers that you can flash. Roger that. Alright. Clear this? Yes. Alright. This one makes health. Let's, let's explore a bit. I think I saw another path I could take, and I want to make sure I don't uh, miss an, any of those gold things. Nope, this is batteries. Can I go, like, above the buildings? Nope. Okay. Alrighty. We go through this teleporter. Warp. Pretty good effect. <laughs> I like that sound effect. That's good. Nice, nice cork pop. Boom, okay. And there's a gold bug there. Wham bam, thank you, man. Alright. This is the blank maker, because I want the question marks. Use your bit beam to flash it. Is that my, or is that my right click? I don't remember. You'll you'll be able to choose what maker will output. Copy that. Okay, so we're going to flash it, and then we choose health bomb, cleaner bomb. Okay. Oh, and then these cost money. What do I make? All right, let's just go with health for now. Trying to figure out what we need. Okay. So it looks like we're gonna to want to make a cleaner bomb. And that's why there's so much money around here. Ugh. Okay. So why don't we go and make a? Ow! Oh! Okay, we need to get out of here. Ah. Oh, we have, we have little cleaner people. Okay, cool. So, work on that while I flash this one. And make a clean bomb. Fire with E. Which is like, bo boosh. Okay, yeah. There's a ton of cleaning. Okay. You guys are cleaning that. These guys. Okay. Let's find another one we could flash. Okay, now can we? Okay, we can't reflash that one. It's already been flashed. Boom! There we go. Now. Hey, how's our how are our robo friends doing now? All right, looks like they just finished up. Those kill you. Head this way. Oh, okay. These batteries hurt a lot. Oh, they just crashing right there. Was that what that was? I don't know. Okay. Now that the battery's clean, that's good. Pick up some more money. Grab this bomb. Blow it right there. Boom. 
Bada that one. And bada bing. What do we got? We got three of those guys now? I thought we had four. Oh well. Flap, flap, flap. So our three friends start cleaning up that mess. So we got more bit buddies. Help with the cleanup patrol. That's right, shoot me. Bit bomb. Boom. Okay. okay. I guess we'll pick up some health. I think we got an achievement. Uh. Now we're gonna go through the danger zone. Ow. Give me my coin. I want it. Uh, okay. You're not making this easy. I'm not even trying to go that way anymore. Please stop. There we go. Okay. Oh, so you know. Oh, I missed a major bug. Darn it. Oh, but I leveled up. Oh, so I could choose what I level up. Um, block speed. I don't know what that means. Uh, let's go with damage. I want to kill those things faster. Alrighty. Um, so yeah, I think that'll be it. Um, for, you know, the actual gameplay stuff here, I'm gonna talk about some points here. Uh, I honestly, I enjoyed it. Um, I do have a slight issue with, like, how low my frames are, um, playing this game. But, like, that can be attributed to many things. One, uh... You know, it's beta, it's entirely possible, it's not not just super op optimized. B, my computer isn't, like, this godsend of a computer. It's just pretty good. So, it's weird, like, I guess, because like, I get 60 frames per second playing Dark Souls 3. So, it's weird to me that I'm not getting 60 frames here. Unless I go down, ugh, unless I go to minimum view distance. Um, so that's something that bugs me a little bit, and might bug some people, but that's, that's kind of up to you to decide. Um, uh, also, the graphics, you know, they're not AAA title graphics, but that's because it's not a AAA company. It's this very, uh, presumably because they say so, very tiny, uh, they even say teeny tiny game development studio. Um, so I don't know exactly how many members, I think, you know, if we went, I'm going to quit, we go to info or whatever, we go to credits. You know, there's what, 3, 6, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14-ish people, at least on this game. That's 14 people making this game. That's, uh, you know, that's... This game's awesome for uh, in my head for 14 people. Uh, I think they did an excellent job uh, for what it is. Um, I don't know how long the game is because uh, we only played the three levels. I don't know to how what extent it is. I also don't know how much it'll be when it comes out. That is not uh, in the email. Um, I would like to assume not too much, um, depending on game length, because that's a big thing. I'd probably say 10 is the most I'd want to spend on this, but that's, again, this is a beta game uh, with no, like, I don't know anyone on it. This is just a, an early access game that they were nice enough to send me, and that's my opinions on it that I've seen so far. I mean, if it's, like, a heck of a long game, you, you know, I like, because I like to do, a lot of people do this, but my kind of judgment is it's, you know, dollars per hour of fun, you know? So, like, you know, I played Doom, and, like, the first, my playthrough of the campaign, you know, just the campaign, was about 10 hours. And I bought it at a full price 60. So that's $6 an hour for fun. And that's a little steep. Now, Doom, it was a lot of fun, and there's potentially more to it. Um, but it's still, you know, that's, that's, 
expensive. But then you take games like Borderlands, where I, again, you know, I probably spent $60 on it, um, you know, you know, for the game itself. But I have almost 300 hours in it. That's a huge thing. So that's, that's how I like to judge it. So if this game, you know, was $10 and it was 10 hours long, you know, a dollar an hour is, is super worth it for this game. But again, that's totally up for you to decide. You know, I'm not here to tell you to buy this game or not. I'm here to show you this game to help you find it if you want it. Um, let me just double check this email to make sure that there's, and there aren't any more points that I'm missing. Um, like I said, August 8th is the release date for the game. Um, this is still early access. This is not the final game, so things are subject to change. Um, mostly the content of the game, I assume, like you do upgrades, things like that. I doubt there'll be a huge overhaul in the next week or two. Um, that's that. And that's it. I think that's it for what we have here. Um, I would like to give a huge thank you to Plastic Games and uh, specifically Eric Johnson, who's the person who sent me the email, uh, for sending me this game and allowing me to do this for them. Uh, as I said at the beginning, this is the first time any company has done this, and I'm very excited that to be given this opportunity. Hopefully this video is helpful to them and they don't hate me afterwards. I doubt it, but you know, people have weird opinions. Um, so other than that, I think that's it. Hopefully you enjoyed. Um, I don't know, like, uh, this isn't my coming back to YouTube video. This is just something I felt I should do because I was given this opportunity and I wanted to. Um, I, you know, maybe I'll stream it on Twitch sometime if, you know, the thing arises. Or, you know, maybe I'll make another video as it comes closer because, like I said, or, like I should be coming back home about the time this game's coming out. So maybe I'll make a second thing there. I don't know. But I, I, I think just final thoughts here. It's fun. Uh, it's enjoyable. It's honestly pretty smooth. Uh, the frame rates might be an issue for some people. Um, I don't know what causes it. I don't know if it's on my end or the game end. Um, hopefully, they'll something will happen about that. Whether it's just you know putting an optimi optimization file in, maybe changing the intensity of some of the uh, distance graphics. I don't know. But that's my only big complaint is the is the FPS. Everything else was fun. The control, like the ship, controlled really well. Um, it was pretty enjoyable. I like to see kind of how in depth the levels got, as because you know the first couple of a couple of levels were just like, you know, stop the virus, and then the you know, last one where you got to kind of customize what you were able to use during the level. Um, so I'd, I'd be interested to see how complex it got at the end. Um, but I think that's it. So hopefully you enjoyed. Um, I'll, I'll, any links of like to the website, you know, I've got a whole bunch of links to uh, that I have access to. I'll I'll put those all in the description, as usual. And hopefully you enjoyed, and I'll see everyone probably on Twitch if you want to join me. <laughs>